Hi, I'm Tony Heiser with KB America. I'm on site today to do a motor learn on 1,000 foot per minute PMAC gearless cars with the MCE Eye Control. To start the motor learn process, you'll need to go to the controller. To do the motor learn, you gotta take control of the car. So what you'll wanna do is you wanna put the car on capture by flipping this toggle switch up and then put it on test by flipping this toggle switch up and putting the car on inspection by flipping this toggle switch up. Next, we go to the drive and enter in the motor data information. So we start by going to parameter LF10. LF10 is the motor rated power for a permanent magnet motor. This value is calculated based off of the motor torque and motor speed. For an induction motor, you'd enter in the motor rated power from the nameplate. Parameter LF11 is the motor rated speed. So here we have 153 RPM. Next is parameter LF12, it's the motor rated current. So you'd enter in the motor rated current. Here we have 85.0 amps. Next parameter is LF13, it's the motor rated frequency. Here we have 40.8 hertz. Parameter LF14 is the motor rated voltage. For permanent magnet motors, this value is calculated as part of the motor learn process. You can enter in the nameplate value, but it may come back as a lower value. For induction motors, you put in the nameplate value. And parameter LF17 is the motor rated torque in foot pounds. So you'd enter in the calculated value here. And for induction motors, this value is calculated based off the motor rated power and the motor rated speed. So next we have to go to the controller and we have to prevent the brake from releasing and set the, the command speed to zero. So now we're gonna go to the eye view to prevent the brake from releasing and set the inspection command speed to zero. To make changes on the controller, first we have to request write privilege by going to write privilege and select acquire. And then from there you'll have to go to the controller to hit accept. To accept write privileges on the controller, you'll have to hit yes. To prevent the brake from releasing on the eye control in eye view, go to uh, the brake settings. And what you'll want to do is you'll want to reduce the brake pick voltage to a minimum such that the brake won't pick. A good example is 20 volts and also the hold voltage. You want to set that to a lower voltage, such as 10 volts. And then from there, you have to send the changes by going to send. To set the inspection speed to zero, what we need to do is go to the pattern settings, go to pattern scaling, and set this to zero. To save those changes, we have to send them to the controller. So now we're ready to start the motor learn process on the drive. Go to parameter LF3, and set it to S learn, and press enter. It'll say start. From there, you have to go down to the controller and give it the inspection command. So here you give it an enable in a direction. Either up or down doesn't matter. And that'll start the process. When the process is complete, the display will read done, and you can let off the inspection command. It'll calculate the motor learned values and save them to the corresponding parameters, and then it's complete.